a success story amid Spain's tale of economic woe. In a time of record unemployment and bankruptcies, clothing giant Mango is defying the odds. This robot-controlled hangar reveals the efficiency behind that success, with 300,000 boxes of clothes ready for customers around the world. We're in the Mango distribution center in Pares del Valles near Barcelona. This center handles all the folded clothes. We get goods from all our suppliers here. Mango may be smaller than its world-leading compatriot Thara, but it has nothing to be shy of. The Catalan brand was born in Barcelona in 1984 and now has 2,500 stores in more than 100 countries, employing 11,000 staff and another 15,000 people in its franchises. The clothes are designed here in Catalonia, and stylists then make the prototypes to be mass-produced in Asia or North Africa. Last year our sales hit 1.4 billion euros, and this year they will probably be around 1.7 billion. We're now selling around 35% more than last year around the world, and 20% more in Spain, because we're not increasing the number of stores here. It's an almost embarrassingly healthy performance in a recession that's left one in four workers unemployed. But Mango has proven it can adapt. Earlier this year, it took a dramatic decision to cut all prices by 20% and to change the style of its collections. We're keeping some of the glamour in the collection, a bit of glamour for special occasions, but we're also developing products that are easier to wear, to go to work in and wear every day. After launching a line of accessories and men's fashion, Mango isn't satisfied with standing still. Now it wants to target a new generation with collections for children and teenagers.